All right, here's what we're gonna do. I'm driving you that junkyard myself. Get you out of my hair, and no one can say I didn't do right by no one. In the meantime, you two can sleep right here and think about what shitheads you were earlier. On my terms and on my timeline. You got me? All right. Fair enough. Fair enough? Go kiss a skunk's ass. I should be earning a goddamn Boy Scout badge for this. Trip, it doesn't seem right to wait. Javi's people, they can need a medic. No, -uh, no way. Not putting you in that kind of danger again. That's not your call. Look, maybe there's another way. We've got a rear gate down at the other end of the airfield. We don't use it much, but... Well, we could leave tonight. Slip past the herd, get a jump start on reaching that junkyard. If your family does need help, I'll be right there to give it. What? Seriously? When you do that for me... It's just... It's the right thing to do. Anyway, think about it. I've got to check on some patients, but I'll be back in an hour. You know, I never would have guessed she had it in her. Yeah. She's... She's something. The thing is, is, and maybe this sounds weird, but I still trust Trip more than I trust her. We're leaving tonight, with Eleanor. If it gets us there even a minute sooner, it's worth it. All right, I'm in. You know, when I met you, I thought you'd just be another asshole like everyone else. And to think that when we first met, you nearly blew my head off. <laughs> yeah, guess I made the right call. Sounds like Eleanor will be a little while. Maybe we should get a few winks. Good idea. I'm exhausted. I'll get the lamp. That's good. Getting into first gear is the hardest part. Now, just stay on the road. <laughs> Most important rule there is. Now, let's try shifting into second. Not bad at all, especially for a first time. You just gotta ease up off the clutch a little smoother, all right? You don't have to make the switch all at once. I want to do it again. You will. And next time, just be gentle. And once we get down to Florida, we'll ditch the wheels and I'll make a sailor out of you. Mark my words. You too, buddy. I just can't get him to talk. It's unusual for his age. Well, the heater's broken. He's cold. Only makes sense to head for Florida sooner than later. Leave all this snow behind, right? Be like summer every day. Hell, I'm gonna have to find me some shorts. Are you sure Florida's better? I'd rather be scared and warm than scared and frozen. I'll teach AJ to fish, how to swim. We'll watch the sunrise every morning. All three of us. But we ain't getting nowhere doing 25 miles an hour. Shift her into third. Let's get her really cooking. There you go, Clem. Time we get to Florida, you'll be a better driver than me. Proud of you, Clem. Hey, I really appreciate you teaching me. You know, I... I always dreamed about the day I'd teach Duck to drive. You're the best second chance I could ask for. Where's your blanket, goofball? I swear this kid never makes a peep. Who knows how long he's gone without a blanket. The duck was gabbing a mile a minute at his age. Wasn't full sentences, but it was something. I think there's something wrong with him. Shouldn't he be talking by now? Well, maybe. 
But let's give him a few more months before we start to worry, okay? Crap! I got it! Turn the wheel! Don't! Okay, Kenny? I'm fine. I'm fine. Is it AJ okay? Shit. Help me up. I don't I don't feel anything. That's good. No. Clem, I don't feel. Anything. I can't feel my legs. I just can't get up. God damn it! Oh my god, no, this isn't happening. This isn't happening! Uh, let me try again. Shit, shit! Hey, hey! Stay away from him! <laughs> Gotta go help AJ Clem. I ain't letting you watch those fuckers chew me up. Go, Clem. No, I won't give up on you. No, Clementine, no. There's no point. Come on, Kenny, help me. Not today, you son of a bitch. Go! Don't look back! Sun's up. <sighs> Chip's probably mad as hell by now. What do you think he'll do to you? Oh, nothing. He'll yell at me a little. Chip and I, we sort of used to be a thing. It was for like five minutes, and it fizzled out fast. But he never really got over it. Not that he's weird about it or anything. I just know he likes having me around. He'd be the first to admit it. Relationships can change pretty fast, and they're never not complicated. Sounds like you've got something on your mind. Or someone. Guys, that's the place. Yeah, this is it. Oh, shit. Guns out, yeah? If you insist. Must have been hundreds of them. Kate's good in a crisis. She'd know how to get shelter. What's that? player Mariana Mariana are you here Javi Oh my god you're safe I can't believe it You told me where to hide I just listened to what you said Lock yourself in and don't come out not even once it's quiet It kept running through my head like on a loop I don't even know how long I was in there then I heard your voice You did exactly what you should have done I always knew you were a smart kid Thanks. It was scary at first, but once the muertos couldn't see me anymore, they just passed by. 
Kate and your brother, where are they? We got pulled apart when that huge bunch of muertos showed up. Kate yelled that they were going to try to make it back to the van. And that's where we're headed. Let's go get your brother back, sweetie. Oh, no. No. No sign of them. They must have seen it like this, then gone someplace else to hide. Kate. They're trapped in there. Ariana, stay back. Wait! Nobody shoots. He's right. We fired the truck, we might hit them. After you. I swear I did. You don't have to snot all over my shirt about it. I thought we were dead. Like, never gonna see you again dead. We only had a couple bullets left. I thought we were done for. There's no way I would let that happen. Yeah, well, you weren't here. The herd showed up and Mariana was gone and we were waiting and, and waiting and then... I was just so scared. I'm here now. You don't have to be scared. Hey. You hurt yourself. You must have scraped it in the truck. Didn't even notice. Hey, at least it's not a bite. Eleanor, think you can take a look? It's okay. I'm a doctor. I'll clean it here, then patch you up back home. See? Better already. We should be getting back. Don't want to push her luck. Who's the kid with the gun? She have a name you want to share with us? Or are you going to make me do my own introductions? Clementine's a friend. Hi there. Glad I was able to help. Well, we're very grateful to you. Really. There's a town nearby. It's safe. I like the sound of that. Oh my god. Javi, do they have hot water? Even, like, lukewarm water would be okay. Ugh, oh, and bubble bath. Wouldn't bubble bath be amazing? I'm sure they do. I'm gonna stay in until my fingers get all pruney. You look happy. I am. Search and rescue missions don't usually end so well. Alive and healthy. Sort of incredible. I... wasn't expecting this. Believe me. To have my family back together again, it's... I'm just... happy for you is all. When we get back to Prescott, you still owe me a working ride. I haven't forgotten about our deal. You couldn't have known what happened to your van, but still, I need some way out of here. I was hoping you might stay. You know, considering... Considering... what? You came all the way out here with me. Yeah, for the van, not for... Cool. Thanks. Hey! 
We can't leave her! Oh! Shit! Oh! Kate! Stop! Stop! Javi, help! Do something, Javi! Do something! Go! We have a window here, Javi! We have to move before they start shooting again! I'm gonna fucking kill them! I'm gonna kill all of them! That's not gonna bring her back, Javi! So what? I'm just supposed to let him live? If you really want to help your family, you'll come with me! We can't wait anymore! We stay here and we finish this! Are you crazy? We have to go, now! I've already killed one of you! If we don't stop them, they're gonna come after your family again! Eleanor, help them. You stay with me. What? No, uh, Javi, you have to come with us. Javi, please! Trust me, Javi. We have to end this now. No, Javi, please come with us. Please! Javi, come on! Get her back to Prescott. We'll cover you. Javi! Go with them. I'll be fine. I need your help, Gabe. Just keep firing until they're out of sight, okay? I'm ready. 